Hello and welcome to the Easy Bundles app, the most flexible bundle builder experience that you will find on Shopify. All of us know bundling is a great way to increase your average order values. However, customers often don't want the preset or curated bundles and want to build their own bundles or their gift boxes. And that's exactly what the app does. Over the next couple of minutes, I'm going to show you how some of our customers are using the Easy Bundles app to create a bundle builder experience that's native to their store. And then we'll talk about some of the features of the app. Before we see the app in action, I want to talk about two things. One, the app is extremely customizable and flexible. So if you have specific requirements, please feel free to reach out to us. And second, we are extremely good at customer service. You can see the reviews on this app or the two other apps that we've built on Shopify. We pride ourselves on the customer service. So feel free to reach out to us if you have any questions while setting it up. With that, let's see the app in action. So the first thing that I want to talk about is different types of bundles. So you can do discounted bundles depending on the products that they're selected, depending on the amount of the bundle. You can give a fixed amount off. You can give a 5% off, 10% off. There can also be a fixed price or a mix and match bundles where you can say, hey, buy X number of products for a Y price and the discount is automatically applied at the checkout. You can also do subscription bundles where people can build their bundles and subscribe to that on a weekly, monthly, bi-weekly basis. So now that you know about the different types of bundles that you can create, let's see the app in action with a few customers that are using the app. The first brand that I want to talk about is a jewelry brand based out of the UK that is using our app to build a custom gift box experience. So this landing page that you see is built by our app along with the four different steps. So you click on create your own gift box and you get onto the actual product listing where you can select different products, you can see more details about the product, you can add them to your box. All of those are listed here. You can also delete the products from right here. And you can then go on to the next step, add a few more products depending on what you want in your gift box. And towards the end of the experience, you will see a summary page with all the products that you've listed along with the order details. And when you click on checkout, all these products are automatically added to the cart and there are no inventory issues because each product is added individually. The next brand that I want to talk about is a German beauty brand that's using our app to build a bundle builder experience where they're giving discounts depending on the number of products that are selected. For two products, there's 5% off. For three products, there's 10% off. This is a mobile experience. I also wanted to show you how this app looks in mobile, which is where most of the shoppers actually shop. So you can add a few different products. You will see all the selected products are right here. You can also delete a product from right here. Go back to building your own box. So I added a few products. I go on to the next step and add a few more products. And this GIF that you see, the loading GIF is also something that can be customized. I can add a gift box if I wanted to and I can continue. This will directly take me to the checkout with discounts automatically applied. The next brand that I want to talk about is a farm based out of Canada that is doing subscription boxes. Yes, so your customers can actually subscribe to the boxes that they create if you do subscriptions on your store. We integrate with apps like AppStill, Recharge or any other subscription app we can work with you to integrate it. This is another layout of the same product page that we saw earlier where products can be split into different categories. So there's a microgreens category, there's a lettuce and greens category and you can split products depending on different categories. Once you add a few things, you will see that a summary page is created where all your products are listed and you can click on subscribe to see a weekly, bi-weekly or a monthly subscription. The next brand that I want to talk about is a stationary brand from the UK where they're using our app to build a pick and mix or a fixed price bundle where they say buy any four items and it's going to be a fixed cost. So when you click on build a box, you'll get to a page like this where there's no price listed because this is a fixed price bundle. There's a condition where it will not let you move forward unless you select the four products. So as soon as I select the four products, I can go to next and go to the checkout process. The next brand that I want to talk about is a cookie brand where they've listed the three different types of bundles on a page and link the different bundles to those boxes. So there's a six count box, eight count box and a 12 count box. And these bundles have different conditions and different discounts. So when you click on shop eight cookies, it takes you to a bundle builder experience where you need to select exactly eight cookies. One of the things that you probably noticed is the app looks different on each store. And that's what I meant by the extreme customization flexibility that the app comes with. And the last thing that I want to talk about is the personalization page where you can have your different greeting cards that are listed and you can select a greeting card. You can also add a message if you want it. And this layout can be customized according to how you want it. I wanted to start off by showing you how our customers are using the app so that you can get a feel for it. What I want to do now is actually talk about the features so you can figure out if this is a good fit for you. You can design a bundle with multiple different steps. It could have one step, three steps, four steps. All of that is customizable within the app. Then there are discounts and filters where you can do automated discounts depending on certain conditions being met. You can also put conditions on the number of products that need to be selected on every single step. 
You can have filters based on the product tags as we saw in one of the stores. And then there is complete customization flexibility where you can customize the layout itself where it says three products, four products on one line, five products in one line, depending on how you want it. There can be a branding and design customization as you probably saw on different stores. Each store looked very different because they have different branding and design customization. The language of the app can be customized as well. If you have any questions, if you need any help with the setup, I'm at sid at giftcard.app. So please feel free to reach out to us.